Uh, Panther, number 610. Uh, Milky, come down. Number 611, horse, come on. about making your debut uh, is it's sort of like we're all from different backgrounds we're all um, got different um, stories to tell but at the end of the day making your debut is, is a common thread that binds us all together it's something that um, the majority of the people in this room have done um, but you know we all we all remember our debuts and you know, I still remember vividly some stuff about it uh, it's such an exciting day and it's something you've basically been looking your whole looking forward to your whole life so uh, just, I'm going to ask you two questions each, so um, I'm just going to ask you, uh, yeah, what it, uh, what it means to you, and who did you tell, who did you tell first? So let's start with you, Mill. Um, yeah, obviously, dream come true kind of thing. Like you grow up, want to do this every day, and um, just to get the opportunity to do it here is um, is something I've always wanted um, since I've come down, and yeah, I really, I think this culture here is something special, and I'm glad to be a part of it this year. And, a bit of last year, so um, the first person I told um, was my older sister. She was, um, yeah. Oh, um, sorry. <laughs> um, yeah, she was, um, she was a bit of a rock kind of thing. Um, through through it all, she sort of kept me there and. Um, and stuck by me, and um, yeah, to tell her that, um, that I was going to have my debut was um, yeah, pretty special, so um, yeah, and then just the rest of the family that was stoked for me, and yeah, I'm just excited to get there and do it for them. Yeah, this, this journey means the world, um, Ivan the boys. Um, I never thought I'd be sitting up here, especially, yeah. Uh, this this year, and I was just hoping to play a bit of consistent footy and um, I got a call out to come up full time. I was just stoked to be <laughs> in around you boys every day. It's, it's a privilege and oh, it's a dream. Like. So, yeah, to be able to play and get my first NRL game is, yeah, I'm over the moon. Um, yeah, first person I told um, when I've told me I rang, I rang mum straight away and um, I, sorry, um, yeah, she was in the car taking part at the hospital and um, they, they just pulled over and mum mum just started bawling. Um, it means yeah, it means a lot to um, me and my family and um, yeah, very grateful. So thank you, thank you very much. Yeah, um, I just want to firstly thank Ivan and the rest of the coaching staff for giving me this opportunity. Um, I didn't, yeah, I didn't think it would come this quick. Like, um, I was talking to mum and dad on the phone the other day, saying, like, when you heard me saying I was being the 19 man squad going up there, I wasn't yet yeah, sure if I was going to play or whatnot. But I was just saying, um, I read in my diary at the start of year before I moved down here to get one New South Wales Cup game as my goal for the year. So, yeah, this I still haven't wrapped my head around. Like, I'm, I think it will sink in until obviously after the game, but um. Yeah, pretty uh, stoked. <laughs> it's unreal. Um, obviously, rang mum and dad first. I know without them, like I wouldn't be holding this jersey. No, yeah, that's a fact. Like if it wasn't for them, then, yeah, I wouldn't be where I am now. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, it means um, it means a lot uh, for the. A rough 12 months really, um, so it just, it just means so much to to come out on top. Uh, it's been been a lot of ups and downs, and 
Uh, yeah, just grateful that you boys stuck beside me and uh, I feel like I owe a lot to this club. Um, just can't wait to get out there and, and repay the faith. Um, yeah, I just caught my old man. Um, sort of been me and him since the start and, and yeah, he, um, he was pretty proud. He sort of just got about the time. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, nah, yeah, so I caught my old man and I just worked my little sister and um, it's been us three since the start, so yeah, um, it means just as much to them as it does to me.